Hey everyone, this is Darren Maralia, VP of Products at Semperis, and I'm really excited to introduce a new free utility that we have available. It's called Purple Knight. What does Purple Knight do? Well, Purple Knight is designed to give you a window into the security posture of your Active Directory environment. It's a simple install. There's actually no install. You just copy the Purple Knight files into a folder on your domain join machine. You don't need any special privileges to run Purple Knight. You just need to fire it up. And once it runs, you'll be able to launch a security assessment of your Active Directory environment. So let me dig into that a little bit and show you what that's all about. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to select the forest that I want to report against. And in my example, I have a lab domain with two domains in it and let me go ahead and go to the next step which shows me all of the security indicators that we're going to be testing and you can dive into the details of each indicator and find out the details around that including the severity the weighting that we give to that indicator the corresponding MITRE ATT&CK TTPs that that particular indicator relates to a description of what the indicator is doing and the likelihood of compromise. Now you can select and unselect individual tests that you're interested in running. We have tests across AD delegation, account security, AD infrastructure security, group policy security, and finally Kerberos security. And we're constantly adding to these indicators. Right now I'm running with 50 indicators, but the next time you get a chance to download the product we'll likely have more. It's a process that we're going through continuously where we're monitoring the most recent attack paths that have been discovered around Active Directory. We're doing our own research to find attack paths and then covering those in security indicators within the tool. Once I have selected the indicators I want to run, then I just run the tests and you can expand the run process to see what each test is doing. But essentially they will go off and execute on their own and in a fairly quick fashion depending of course on the size of your AD environment and when they complete you'll get a chance to see sort of what what the output looks like so now that it's finished you'll see that I'm given an overall score and this environment is looking pretty sad I've got a score of 56 percent or an F and then each category is scored separately as well so I'm doing slightly better in Kerberos security than I am in many of the other categories, but still lots of issues in this environment. Now obviously I want to be able to dig into the environment, find out what the issues are and how I might be able to solve them. And to do that, I can either view a full HTML report or I can save the report to PDF. So if I go ahead and save or view the, the HTML report, it's going to come up in my browser. And as you can see, it shows me the most critical indicators of exposure first and I can click on a link here to dive right into it and it will tell me why what happened here why this was bad and in this case you can see that I've got a domain that's set to allow anonymous access to Active Directory which is definitely not a good thing And we have some remediation information that allows you to, to look into and see exactly what needs to be set or configured to fix this. And again, this, this is going through each of the indicators in detail, showing you again the description, the severity, the weighting, the MITRE ATT&CK TTP, the result of the, of the actual objects that were returned, and any remediation steps that you need to take. So this is a quick overview of Purple Knight. I hope you found it useful. Again, I look forward to having everyone give this a try in their environment. Bring us some feedback on how you think it looks in your environment. Give us ideas on new indicators that you'd like to see. The, the tool is growing and changing all the time, so I uh, really look forward to getting this out into the community and, and seeing how we can bring some benefit 